Assalamualaikum So for our Arduino project We thought about what could be convenient for people to use So we've come up with this solution Where pet owners When they are away or too busy They are not able to feed their pet on time So like cats The pet owners knows that a cat will eat either about 12 hours in between their meals so when they're away for a few days they need something or an apparatus to feed the cat for them so we've come up with this Arduino pet feeder what it is is a pet feeder that we can program the Arduino to allow food to dispense every 12 hours or so so this is our project So for our Arduino project, we will be needing one Arduino Uno, one standard servo, a power source, an acrylic sheet or perspex, wires, hinges and screws. So for the process, first we cut out the perspex and join them together using hot glue guns and then we connected the components using um, the Arduino Uno, LEDs, the wires and servos we cut out the wheel of the Arduino and attach them to CDs to make a perfect circle finally we mounted all the components into the final apparatus we hot glue gun the servo to the back piece attach the wheel to the servo and attach an exit ramp at the bottom of the apparatus so then the final pet feeder is completed we wired up the Arduino into the laptop and fit in these codes So this is day one of our trial. I've completed all of it, set up my Arduino, and let's try something to shoot. Okay, so this is my second attempt. I think I fixed why it fell before. Let's see. I don't know why it's vibrating. Okay guys, so this is my attempt number 4. I think I fixed it but I don't know. It was vibrating before, but it seems to work now. And it's vibrating again. So I think maybe I need to tighten this again and I don't know, add some more improvements to it. Okay, so this is my seventh attempt. I think I figured out why it went wrong. It was a bit loose there. So let's try this. The LED seems to be working well. And it's good. So let's try to fit all the components in. Mm -hmm. 
So from the previous test, we saw that all the mechanical components work. So I've loaded this top tray and put some rolled up newspaper as an example of pet food. So from here, the pet food will fill this part of the tray. It will drop down to this side of the wheel. When the time comes, the wheel will turn and drop the food here. So this Arduino is connected to 12 volt battery and there are two LEDs. The red light will blink until there is 3 seconds left and then the green light will blink until the food drops. So our project is a success. Uh, I've set the timer to 10 seconds, but obviously the user will set to about 12 hours depending on the pet.